electrician and whatever you say. Fine. <laughs> Sure, Shannon Show. Today we're going to do an unboxing video. Got this package in from Audacity Games today. Audacity Games is a uh, retro uh, style game developer. They developed such hits as Circus Convoy. Today we're going to have a look at their new game called Alien Abduction. For those of you who may or may not know, Audacity are the former uh, owners of the old school Activision titles on your old Atari from back in the day. Um, these guys developed some of the best games from Atari and nowadays they're called Audacity. So here's the second game that they've uh, developed. Let's open this sucker up and have a look. This is the VIP Collector's Edition. So there should be all kind of good stuff in here. Packing list, Audacity logo on it, bubble wrap, oh first thing I'm seeing, looks like a poster, let's have a look at it, whoa, oh wow, that's like a 1950s style horror sci-fi oh wow it's got all the the credits of the developers no one was allowed to leave the theater she thought she was going to a drive-in not to an alien abduction well that's really neat I'm gonna I'm gonna get a frame for that sucker I don't know if you can see that there try not to crease it but yeah, there's the poster. That's pretty cool. We're off to a good start. I like that. Looks like we got a nice hat. Alien Abduction VIP. You too can be abducted by an alien with Audacity Games. All right. Moving right along. Uh-oh. Oh, little PVC alien figure. That's really cool. Wow, this table's not very level, but I bet he's got a way to make him stand and display. That's really cool. I'm a huge action figure collector, so that'll fit right in with my stuff. I'm liking that. What else we got in here? Uh-oh. We got a lanyard. Get this sucker open. Oh, wow. Like I said, this is the VIP Collector's Edition. There's, uh, there were only 150 of these made. And I'm not sure what that QR code is, but uh, it's got my name on it. And out of 150 copies of this, uh, I have number 41. This just went on sale last week. Got it in the mail today. That is really cool. I will hang that up somewhere. Yeah, that'll look really nice. Now with their previous game, Circus Convoy, they offered patches. I need to get a better frame for this. But uh, these are the patches that, uh, that inclu was included with the game. Um, then when you beat the game, uh, you got this perfect game patch again I need to make a better better display for that uh, Circus Convoy came out a couple years ago I actually met these guys from Audacity Games at a video game convention a month or so ago and uh, they autographed it this was developed by David Crane and Gary Kitchen super nice guys they uh, had a panel uh, discussion about this alien abduction so I've been super excited about this, and I just love what they've done uh, so far. They do have a third game coming out later this year called Casey's Gold. 
which is a sequel of sorts to this circus convoy so whenever I, that gets released maybe we'll do another unboxing video all right now look at that. great great shipping bubble wraps uh you know things get damaged in shipping uh all the time they went out of their way to package everything nicely uh let's let's open this sucker up oh what's this audacity games oh certificate of authenticity uh john van risen is the programmer and developer of alien abduction there's the uh, certificate, the number 41 of the 150 of these VIP collector's editions. He programmed a game for Activision back in the 80s called HERO. It's an acronym, H-E-R-O. You uh, navigate a guy through these caves to save these trapped people. Excellent game. So what they discussed at the panel that Alien Abduction is a... Uh, sort of sequel to that old school hero. Look at that collector's edition. Got it on the got it on the box. Beautiful artwork. I, I'm a huge science fiction fan. So we'll get to some uh, hopefully some gameplay footage. Uh, here in a minute but uh let's see how this opens up wow they've got that sealed really well Ooh -wee. there we go all right looks like we got a little tab here there we go Let's see what's inside. They really package this. There it goes. Oh. Nice and shiny label. A nice shot of the game. It looks very similar. There's the Circus Convoy cartridge. The nice shiny labels on this thing. It kind of mimics and is reminiscent of those old Activision Atari games. You know, Pitfall and Kaboom and River Raid. Now what's neat about these is when I put these in the Atari, it'll take me immediately to a QR code that I scan and it, it'll take me to their website through my phone and it'll have my name and my account and it'll say welcome Brad Odom at least that's what the Circus Convoy did and I thought that was very high tech because this plays through an original Atari it's all original hardware but they've somehow utilized it to the max uh, Circus Convoy has like a couple hundred different screens and levels and it does some things that no other Atari game uh, did back in the day uh, this also included a, a ROM version that I could download and play onto an emulator. So I've already been playing this game all week, and it's great. Uh, I've had a lot of fun. Of course, the physical co copy is uh, great to collect, and it's going to be a lot of fun to play down here in my video game room. But uh, it looks like we got a manual and some other goodies in here. So let's have a look. Oh, the instruction booklet. Nice and glossy. Uh, very high quality paper. Here's your instructions. You can play with a classic Atari joystick. Personally, I play with a, uh, a lot of people didn't know it, but a Genesis, a Sega Genesis controller works on your Atari. And uh, I like that, the D-pad function a little more than the classic joystick. So I tend to play with that. Shows you how to register the game. A uh, little bit about John and a little bi background and biography on him. There's a QR code, which I'm... Oh, that's for the, the online guide, which will have a lot of this. You know, especially for the people that don't like to open stuff and uh, just, you know, you get collectors like that. 
I'm not like that, um, especially with video games. Games, I think, are meant to be open and played, and uh, as well as collected, but you get those people that don't open things, so they have a QR code um, to, to scan this and get this exact manual online that shows you the gameplay. You're, you're, the, you're this guy, and you're in these, uh, this alien ship, and you gotta rescue the people that have been abducted by aliens. You get all kind of obstacles. You got a gun to shoot with. You got a jet pack that flies you up and down the screens and through the levels. So really nice description here. Uh, a lot nicer than your classic Atari game manuals that were just a page or two on really cheap paper. So they've done a nice job. Um, yeah, here's, here's the patches that they'll send me. Um, I actually reached this uh, spec four level uh, the other day on the online on the uh, emulated version and then you'll get this hero I think there's 80 total levels in this is what they were saying um, which is a lot and I think you get this when you hit level 20 oh, le level 15 there you go so just a lot of fun stuff they do with the game you know uh so it's just more, you know, adds, adds to the fun of just playing a game and having it. So uh, now here, and I'm going to be really excited about that. Here they're advertising this Casey's Gold game, which will be their next one. Hopefully it comes out before the end of 2024. Um, it is somewhat a sequel to the Circus Convoy that I showed you earlier. So I'm really excited about that as well. Uh, I just think Audacity is doing some great things and have some great ideas. Uh, there's your credits for, for everything. National Video Game Museum, that's really cool. So uh, that's the instruction manual. It really looks sharp. We've got something else in this box. Oh, just a, a warranty, just a description of kind of the, the text or the, the, the specs behind it. So that's, that's kind of nice. I feel something else in there. Uh-oh. Do we have another poster? Oh, we do. It's a smaller version of that big boy I showed you. There, that'll, that'll show up on screen a little better. So I got that one and the, the full size. So one of those will be in a frame and on my wall within the next couple of days. Uh, that looks like everything there. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, that's going to be alien abduction. We'll try to get some uh, gameplay footage for you here in a second. Uh, just really excited about this and glad to be a part of the Sure Shannon show and told him about it. And he was happy to come on over and he was really interested too in this, so uh, hope you enjoyed this video. We're going to uh, uh, try to get some gameplay for you here in a second. So uh, thanks for watching the Sure Shannon Show. Brad Odom, Alien Abduction unboxing video. How exciting. Let's go to the game. Here we go, alien abduction. You'll notice on the bottom left to register the game, this has a QR code. Now I've already registered what they gave me online, but for fun, I'm going to scan this and see what happens. It is so it gives me a link on my phone that takes to me, me to my account on audacity games has me log in and it says welcome Brad Odom which is pretty neat Atari games obviously did not have QR codes back in the day 
So I've registered my game onto my account. So we're ready to play this thing. All right, so as you fly and land, and uh, in the very bottom left, you see how it scrolls, published by Audacity Games. That's kind of like what those old Activision games did back in the day. So you press right to play, and here we go. So I'm this guy. Those red things are health. You'll see that you have uh, two bars. Yellow for energy that kind of ticks down, and then red for uh, health. And then I save this girl right there. There's level one. Shoot some of these aliens. Yeah, those yellow things improve your energy. The red one's your health. You just fall down through the levels. There's a heart, which gives you extra lives. You can push down and set off these bombs. And there's level two. Obviously, each level is going to get a lot more difficult. Those red flashing walls cause damage. Set that bomb. You got these aliens shooting at you. Some sort of alien lava. And there's level three. So, a few more obstacles. If you're not familiar with the old Activision game Hero, look that up. Uh, you'll see it's very similar. This is sort of a sequel. But uh, I've been playing this all week on the emulator from the link that they sent me. I'm about to run out of energy. And I'm dead. Oh, and that's game over. <laughs> that's Alien Abduction, folks, from Audacity Games. Check it out. Audacitygames.com. I met I met them, like I said, at a uh, video game convention recently, and they're all really nice guys, and they're doing great work out there. Um, I look forward to everything that they do in the future. Hopefully, they keep cranking these games out, and I I hope people buy them and they have great success. And if you're a Sure Shannon fan and an Atari game fan, I recommend Audacity Games. And uh, I think that's about it for our video. Thanks for watching, everybody. Sure Shannon Show 2024.